Yes, hello guys. Uh, let me show you how to use the ACT Made Easy app that runs on handheld TI Inspire CX and also CX CAS. So it runs on both handheld uh, type TI Inspires. So you can see here on the left we are taking care of you perfectly. We have you covered in terms of algebra, functions, polynomials, points, lines, quadratic functions, complex numbers, exponential logarithmic functions, sequences and series, matrices, trigonometry, circles, geometry, conversions and some specific ACT topics. So I would like to give you a few samples in the algebra section. You can quickly um, solve any type of equation just change the equation and the answer changes right away. Similarly, you can also change, uh, I mean, solve a 2x2 two two or 3x3 three three system. Also, we have rules in here, like the PEMDAS rule that you sometimes may need to remember. And it's uh, listed here for you and also actually exemplified. Um, functions all-in-one function explorer type in your function and quickly see what the x-intercepts y-intercepts are the symmetry minimum or maximum of the function next uh, polynomials all-in-one polynomial explorer so enter a polynomial and then scroll up See the degree of the polynomial, the coefficients, the leading coefficient, dominant term, uh, the zeros, and also the possible rational zeros. Um, points and lines. Say you're given um, two points. One, two, three, four, or three, five. You enter them here, and you will quickly see, scroll up, the midpoint the distance and the slope and also the uh, equations passing through the two points in point slope form, slope intercept format or standard form. So very handy. Quadratic equations. Complete the square for example. Type in your quadratic equation. Scroll up and see the steps that are used to complete the square right here and then also you can complete the square to find zeros or to find vertices you can also do the quadratic equation step by step just enter the equation and the coefficients are extracted 1, negative 6 and 10 plugged into the quadratic formula it's uh, simplified step by step until you arrive at the solutions 3 minus i and 3 plus i. Exponential and logarithmic functions. You see what we have here in uh, offered for you. Um, so let's solve a exponential money problem. Say you're given a future value and you want to know the principal. You leave the principal box blank and then you look in the bottom, the principal turns out to be 670. Change the future value, say 10,000, and then the principal changes immediately to 6,700. Sequences and series. Um, let's go geometric sequence and series. You enter a geometric uh, sequence formula, and then you get all the information. The common ratio is one half. The leading term is uh, G1, the first term G1. And since the common ratio's absolute value is less than one, the sequence converges and its sum, the series, then approaches three. Okay, matrices. You can find inverse, determinant, row echelon, and also Kramer rule. So let's do Kramer rule. You enter a matrix here. One, two. Let's scroll up. One, two in the first row, three, four in the second row, and the right side, three, seven. So we're going to find the determinant. 
of the matrix which is negative 2 and the other two determinants and those determinants are used then to figure out the solution x, y. Again, if you change any answer, you immediately change the solution, of course. Trigonometry, um, you can solve any triangle. So you have to enter exactly three information. Say you enter three, four, five. That gives you a right triangle, 90 degrees and the other two angles are 36 and 53 and the area of this triangle is 6 because 3 times 4 over 2 is 6 circles here you can read circle uh, definitions, properties let's say we're gonna use the sector formula enter a angle like 90 degrees and we find the sector to be 0.78. If we're given the sector of let's say 0.7 and we leave the angle blank, then we are finding the angle here. So we can solve for the unknown easily and quickly. Uh, geometry, you can have all solve uh, for given any shape from two dimensional shapes to three dimensional shapes. Let me just give an example. It works the same fashion I just showed you. Here you're filling in one box. Say you know the radius three, you find the circumference in the area. And if you know the area, you just enter the area and um, the radius and the circumference are found for you. Conversions. You can do rectangular polar conversion, degree radian, degree to degree minutes and seconds, or also revolutions to degree. So as an example, say I'm given 3, 4 as rectangular coordinates, and then the radius and the angle are 5 and 53 degrees. Okay, and then here are some ACT specials. Say you have to find... Uh, or count the numbers, integers, given a range. Let's say the range is 1 through 100 and say your magic number is 7 then watch what we have here for you. There are 19 integers between 1 and 100 that contain a 7. That also means 81 integers don't contain a 7. How many numbers are divis divisible by 7 between 1 and 100? That would be 14. So 87 integers are not divisible by 7. How many integers have repeating digits between 1 and 100? That's 10 of them from 11 to 99. And the sum of the first 100 integers is 50-50. Okay, so that's one of the special ACT problems. And we have others here as well. And altogether, this SAT made easy up is obviously very powerful because it covers all possible sections of SATs, SAT tests. So you can quickly verify if you did something correct or not. Well, thank you for watching. Find this app at tiinspireapps.com. Have a nice day.